after their contentious first wedding, Blake Lively and Ryan Reynolds secretly wed again. Blake Lively and Ryan Reynolds have been blissfully married since 2012, but their first wedding was contentious, and after facing backlash over the location they chose, they decided to get married again. On September 9th, the pair got married at Boone Hall Plantation in Mount Pleasant, South Carolina. Ryan later called this a giant mistake when he and Blake came under fire for romanticizing a location where black slaves were formerly subjected to violence. Ryan said as much in the September 2020 issue of Fast Company. It's something we'll always be deeply and unreservedly sorry Sorry for, Ryan stated. Reconciling is impossible. On Pinterest, we had been looking at a wedding venue. What we observed thereafter was a setting constructed upon terrible tragedy. Ryan's and Blake's wedding was among the images of plantation weddings that were removed off Pinterest in response to the uproar. Weddings ought to stand for love and harmony. Plantations don't stand for any of those things, a Pinterest representative claimed at the time. We continue to not accept advertisements for them and are working to limit the distribution of this content and accounts across our platform. Ryan did not give any specifics about their special day in the same interview, but he did mention that he and Blake afterwards had a covert second wedding at their house. We were married at home years ago, but shame has strange ways of working. A big error like that can either make you shut down or it can change the way you look at things and get you moving, he said. It doesn't guarantee you won't use an expletive again. However, changing and opposing ingrained societal conditioning is a never-ending task. A dessert table with sweet treats, a glimpse of Blake's stunning custom-made Marchesa gown with gold embroidery, and their Lorraine Schwartz wedding bands were just a few of the elaborate details that the couple shared with Martha Stewart weddings on their first wedding day. Blake later admitted to Vogue that the day after she burned her wedding dress, she had a heartbreaking moment. I get so angry when something goes wrong, she admitted. For instance, my bridal gown. At the reception, Florence Welch was performing, and as she was singing, sparklers were brought out. Fortunately, her viewpoint was altered by a comforting message from her spouse. And later, my dress was hanging up, and Ryan said, isn't that beautiful? She continued, what? I yelled. He then indicated the burn. It was such a delicate little matter that my heart simply stopped. He said, and he replied, you'll always remember that time with Florence singing and the sparklers. You have that there, saved, for all time. That is currently my favorite feature of the dress.